We're going to be in 1 Corinthians 15. You'll find that on page 1142 in your Pew Bibles, 1 Corinthians 15. We'll be reading the first uh, 34 verses, though the sermon will be particularly focusing on 23 through 34, but we'll read the first 34 verses will be good for us. I'll begin then at 1 Corinthians 15, verse 1. Now, now I would remind you, brothers, of the gospel I preached to you, which you received, in which you stand, and by which you are being saved, if you hold fast to the word I preached to you, unless you believed in vain. For I deliver to you as of first importance What I also received, that Christ died for our sins in accordance with the Scriptures, that He was buried, that He was raised on the third day in accordance with the Scriptures, and that He appeared to Cephas, then to the twelve, then He appeared to more than five hundred brothers at one time, most of whom are still alive, though some have fallen asleep. Then He appeared to James, then to all the apostles. Last of all, as to one untimely born, He appeared also to me, For I am the least of the apostles, unworthy to be called an apostle, because I persecuted the church of God. But by the grace of God, I am what I am, and his grace toward me was not in vain. On the contrary, I worked harder than any of them, though it was not I, but the grace of God that is with me. Whether then it was I or they, so we preach, and so you believed. Now... If Christ is proclaimed as raised from the dead, how can some of you say 